Hey, what's up guys, WRG here in a video and I have a pretty cool product review for you guys today. This is a light that if you guys are not familiar with, uh, CAA, they make really cool products. They also make the Micaroni, which is the, basically turns your pistol into like a short barrel rifle or converts it to a pistol with a brace. So pretty cool products they have. And what I have here is something that is compatible with the micro Roni in case you do ever decide to purchase that, or it's functional for many other purposes, as you'll see here in a second. I have your safety checked Glock 19 and the official bottle opener of WRG. So 50 cal bottle opener. I'll leave links for everything down below so you guys can check everything out. So this light is called the MRFLMC. I will be doing some field testing with it, so make sure you stay tuned for that. So it is 500 lumens, two different packaging here, right? So the reason is, First one is just the case. So if you just wanted to buy in the hard body of the light without the actual light, here it is. So that's pretty much how it'd come. And you guys see here, they have pretty cool, their logo on it and very well constructed. So, and if you want to buy the complete set, which I recommend, this is the four in one. And this is basically how it'd look. Let's get this out of the way. Pretty cool packaging, by the way. And in case you guys wanted to read that, so pretty cool stuff. So this is what you'd get. And here's a complete package. It is a 500 lumen light inside. So very easy to use. All you gotta do is press on the left hand side here. I have it configured. You could either configure it to left hand or right hand. So this side, for example, is non-functioning at this moment, but you could configure it to work on one side or the other. And that's pretty cool to avoid negligent discharges. So that's pretty much it. And like I said, it's four in one. So what are the four different features of this particular light? The first one is going to be as configured now, which is on your belt. So you could easily clip this to your belt and you have a light ready to go as a handheld light. So if you want to use it as a handheld light, all you gotta do is pull on these tabs and there you go. You just push down on it and pull this towards the light. So you can see these tabs, how they work. Basically it goes down and this piece We'll move down, allowing it to release from this Picatinny rail adapter. And if you guys notice, this is very similar to the bottom of your Glock, which is how it would attach there as well. So right now you have a handheld light and this light is very much compatible with the micro Roni. So you could easily just slip that in. And that's another one of its features, which is pretty cool if you guys ever wanted to get that product. And then lastly, obviously it could go onto a pistol. So I have here my safety check pistol and I'll show you guys right now how that works. Mind you, I will be taking it to the range and I will be doing some testing with it, show you how bright it is. It is 500 lumens. Again, this has been safety checked and I'll show you guys how it works. So you have two different options. The most ergonomic is right here in the back. So you can just press in on it. You don't really have to break your grip and it can be pretty quick. You just illuminate and out. Or I guess if you want to go up front, you potentially can, but honestly, it's pretty much built to do it from the back end, which is probably the most ergonomic and best way to do it. If you want to take it off, it's very quick easy to remove on and off. You guys hear a little bit of an audible click when it goes in. I'll do it carefully for you guys to check it out. So that's it. It's in pretty good, solid. And then that's how the light will work. And then remove it. I'm just gonna show you one more time in case you guys wanna check out that audible click. It's actually pretty good, especially on the handheld belt clip. So here it is and clicks on. So it is pretty strong and audible. So off, on, and you're locked in, good to go. So I've shown you guys how it looks. I've unboxed it for you guys. Let's do some field testing with it and see how it performs. Lock 19, I'm gonna be testing it out. Adding 10 rounds. So shoot seven yards. perfectly well. 
So let's try it again. Secure fit. Turn around. So a quick caveat I'd like to mention is that I did try this light out with my Glock 20, which is 10 millimeter, which has unfortunately has a very strong recoil. And this light was not able to stay on to the Glock 20 throughout more than three rounds, although it clicks in. So I reached out to CAA just to clarify. And they told me that at this moment, the MRFL MC, which is this light, is compatible with Glock models that are also compatible with the Micro Roni for Glock, only the ones with nine millimeter caliber. So that's directly from them. So just so you guys are aware. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to break it down real quick, and then we're going to compare it against a few other lights. So, all you got to do is push that down. And of course, breaking down, and then you tap on these on either side, and you pull. And breaking it down is pretty cool in case you want to use the actual small light within. You have these little tabs here, and you just kind of break those apart. So, yeah, the purpose of this is so you could get the small light out, or if you wanted to just change the orientation, for example, right now it's set to this side to work, as you guys can see. And that's because of this button, but you can just switch it over to the other side, and then you'll have the other side working. Or, if you want to just use this light, for example, if you're camping or something like that, you just want a small light that you can carry in your pocket, it does have a small lanyard loop here that you guys could use. Not sure if you guys can see that. There it is. So you could put a small lanyard loop in there, and you should be good to go. So let's test out the light and see how it compares to other lights. I'm about seven feet away from this door and let's see how the MRFL MC works out. So just on and that's 500 lumens right there. Now I'm going to compare it to the TLR1. So I have the TLR1 here, as you guys can see. So let's test this one out see how it does, compares. So TLR1 is on the bottom, MRFL MC on top. Turn it off. So you guys can see you get a little bit more visibility with the MRFL MC, a little less focus and a little wider cone of light. So you did have a little more flooding. Let's compare it to the Surefire X300. This is the 600 lumen version. So you can see that on the bottom. So definitely a much hotter spot. You do get a lot more flooding with the MRFL MC. So try that one more time. Turn that off. So this is just the X300, and this is the MRFL MC. So if you have the Micro Roni, specifically in 9mm, I would say this is a must-have. I really like this. It's very modular. 500 lumens every time you click it, no matter what. There's no SOS or different modes. You always get the brightest setting, which is pretty nice. It's a nice tactical feature to have. I also liked it like this in handheld. All you got to do is slip a lanyard through if you want, as it has a lanyard loop right there. And very convenient to put in your pocket without the body now if you want to add the body it's also very simple i'm going to assemble it here so you guys can see and it's pretty cool i think if you had the nine millimeter micro roni it's pretty convenient to add it from one feature to another like from your glock or directly to the micro roni so definitely a must have i think if you had that accessory and even if you don't i think it's still a pretty cool accessory to have so all you gotta do is hold here clicks on in and then this is the belt clip clicks in and you're good to go so thanks for watching guys if you have any questions, please leave it down below. Like, share, subscribe. And like I said, I'll leave links below so you guys can check that out. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. WRG, out.